I'm here once again with Kelly Jones to show you how to tackle all the technical sections here at Virginia Key. The last video we did together got a great response and someone left in the comments section something to the effect of, I wish you guys would do something like this at Virginia Key. So we thought it was a good idea and here we are. Hi guys, we are here at a beautiful park in Miami and it's one of the only places that I know of where you can ride your bike and see the beautiful water and Fisher Island and even a little bit of Miami, so it's pretty cool. So we're excited to be here. All right, we are on a wild thing and there's a drop. So I'm gonna send it like a normal drop and then see if you can roll it. Okay, so this is Stairway to Heaven, um, which is a pretty popular feature in Virginia Key. Um, I know that some beginners do um, get nervous and there is a, a go around, but um, it's actually a really easy feature. Um, obviously, if you're a more of an expert rider, you can like huck off the top of it and kind of clear and almost land on the bottom. Um, but if you are a newer, um, which is kind of what we're gearing towards, I want to point out that you cannot roll down this if you're sitting on your bike. So you have to get out of the saddle if you've sat for the climb once you get to the flat on the top. When you come to the top, you, you should be in a neutral position over your bike. So then you want to shift your weight back just a little bit, keep a nice bend in the knee, a good bend in the elbow, and you can just roll gently down. Um, don't need to hit your brakes, just let your bike go and it, you'll go down super smooth. It's real easy. All right, these jumps are not yet open. That one looks like a drop that you have to actually drop. This is the start of Another One Bites the Dust, the blue wooden roller coaster trails at VK. And in my opinion, blue should be the rating of this trail. It's not a particularly technical section, except for the skinny at the end. There are no mandatory gaps, but you can launch a couple spots. Just make sure to stay on the blue wood and you'll be fine. I enjoy making these free videos for you all. If you're enjoying them, you can show your support by simply clicking these three buttons now. Kelly smashed her face somewhere up here, so naturally we're gonna revisit it. Okay. So. Okay, so we are at a feature, um, a little rock feature here. Uh, there's actually a couple of lines on this particular feature. Um, the one that the trail points to and suggests is obviously straight this way. Um, you know, with this, you're definitely gonna have to come in with a little bit more momentum and you're absolutely gonna have to lift um, your front wheel up, um, up onto the rock. So momentum and lift of the wheel is gonna be imperative. However, um, another line that I like to take is kind of coming off the trail a little bit. 
Um, so the suggested trail is this way. Um, you come this side and you can actually roll up onto the rocks right there. Again, you do need a bit of momentum and you're gonna have to lift a little bit, but there's no gap. It's a little less scarier. Um, the last time I did this particular feature, and I haven't done it again since, I had a pretty bad mess up. Um, we all make mistakes. And I actually came to the other side, which I wanna point out to you. So there is a little drop off. And if you stay far right, you can roll right off of that, no problem whatsoever. However, I was not paying attention and came too far left, which you can do, but you definitely lead to lift off of this. I did not do that. I let my front wheel drop off, went straight over the handlebars and smashed my face. So don't do that. And now we're gonna show you how you should do it. Come in. The run up for this section kind of sucks. I think important to know about these trails is to use the berms and leg positioning. Yeah, if I was low in those berms, I would have slid out. Okay, so we are at Highway to Hell, which is, I would say, my favorite part of Virginia Key. It's a little bit old school as far as a lot of wood features, like the whole trail is wood features, and you get absolutely gorgeous shots of the water as you're coming around bends. It's like spectacular. So we'll show you a little bit in the video, but this is their qualifier. Um, so we have a qualifier at Markham. This is the qualifier for here, a little bit different. Um, the qualifier at Markham, we showed a couple different ways. Um, this one, you're not gonna be able to just roll up it. Um, it does dip and then, you know, there is a little bit of a rock here. So the cleanest line is gonna be straight up the middle. Um, you are gonna have to pedal and you are gonna have to lift your wheel up here. Um, it's not gonna be a big lift, um, but just a little bit to get up and over and it's gonna be a pedal through. And then again, a tiny little lift here, not much. Um, and then you drop down the other side. So um, we'll do it and then we'll go see some awesome views. I was not very smooth up it. My back wheel was like clunk. Oh, sh <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Knowing the trail is a big key factor in this particular thing, right? Like I've never gone off the side before, but whatever, like it can happen. So. I think knowing the trail is important for this particular one, but if you came around the berm, you're in the wrong gear. That's a bit of a toughie shifting quick. All right, we're gonna hit this again. Get into a little bit easier pedaling gear for the climb. Stay left, boom. Pop over that log, not bad. That one requires commitment. Let's make sure this is. Gives you an idea how deep. Woo! Okay. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. There's a little bump here. Um, and then when you get here, little off timber, sloping down and out, kind of weird, but it's not that big of a deal. 
it's just committing, you know, because it's about mm, four feet, three, four feet. Out. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. You freaking pulled that off though. <laughs> I, got it on video. I got it. I was so impressed that you adjusted so quickly and you saved it. Like, it was like a cat. Okay, we are now coming to my favorite part of the trail. All right. Look at that view. Yeah. It's okay, guys. Right. It's pretty awesome here. Yeah. <laughs> that was sick. Super sick. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. Okay, this is wool pigs. Important here, nice neutral position on the bike. Nice bend in the legs. Everything is rollable. It's just being confident on the bike. And when I say neutral, I mean keeping your body centered over your bottom bracket. It makes me laugh in Virginia Key because I've crashed so many times here. Some caught on videos, some not. I had a handlebar through my chin right here. Get some momentum for this. Roll straight off it, no problem. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, like seriously. <laughs> It's okay to stop, but you got to make sure you listen for people. That's right, you guys. It's okay. You got earphones in? Yeah, that's a yes. <laughs> a little rollable stairs here. And this little section through here is nice and flowy. It's a little loose. There's a climb coming up around the corner. This particular crime, climb, crime, is all about momentum. Momentum is your friend. Okay, so this is the exit climb of War Pigs. So we just kind of went through War Pigs. Um, there's some techie sections in there. This climb, I do see a lot of people not make it up. Um, honestly there's not anything that you have to do as far as like lifting your wheel or anything along those lines. The key to this honestly is momentum. So I, I don't recommend being in a super duper easy gear. I recommend coming in at a good clip um, in a decent gear and you can maybe downshift once or twice. Did I mess you up? Sorry guys. Oh, yeah. No, not at all. No, Sorry. No. I thought I scared you, no, so I thought no, it was no, my no, fault. No, just no momentum. And once I got, I'm like... Yeah, we're I'm just going. talking about how to climb it and we're talking about momentum. Yeah, it's the momentum. Yep. Exactly. If you don't take that turn with momentum, you're... Right. Yeah. Come in at a decent gear, shift down right before you hit the climb once or twice, um, and then attack the climb. Shift once.
Did not know that was coming. The end. I'm dead. Burnout. Whew.